as you know, this blog is about de-stressing as a mom. And the way I de-stress as a mom is by getting quick workouts in throughout my day or if I have the luxury in actual 45, 60 minute time frame. And so as I discussed in the blog, you want to have some steps to really master this and be successful in your programming. One is to be honest. And I had to be really honest with myself when I looked at my time and how my timeline of my day went out, how many times were I, was got, I getting distracted and that was eating up my time with actually getting onto the total gym for a workout. I could easily get distracted with laundry and dishes and all sorts of things, but I had to say if I had 15 minutes, and as I talk about, I tell myself, do I delegate it, do I do it, do I defer it? And if I can do any of those, then I get right into my workout. The next thing step was about clarity, having clarity as to what are your goals and oftentimes we have a weight loss or a very short-term goal. And I encourage you to think outside your box and think a bigger global goal. My global goal is to really increase my buffer zone of health. Having a neurological issue, I really want a really big buffer zone of health. And that gets me motivated every day. And the same aspect, my family is a huge motivator. I want to be able to run around and play with my kids. So that, on days that I don't want to do it, that gets me right onto this machine. The next step is having, again, building on the clarity of goals are my motivators. Not only do once I get here, I have to stay in the game. And in the beginning, it might mean making it through a TV show. It might mean having great music and just being able to zone out. I want you to know what will also drive you, not only to get on the machine, but keep you going in your workout. Take you one more step in maybe adding another set, increasing your intensity. And the next thing is having a list and I say little circuits that you can do that can make you feel successful. We often get bogged down with saying I need 50, 60, 70 minutes for a workout. I want you to think just in small chunks, 5 minutes, 10 minutes, 15 minutes, so that you have in your back pocket what I've designed are little circuits. And you can either do this whole routine as one big circuit or you can take each one individually and just do that circuit three or four times. And you'll be amazed. You actually will be sore the next day. I try to put it that... You have an overall little full body effect um, in each circuit. So, and if not, maybe one or a little bit more upper back, which we all need as moms since we're, our lives are so much here. So I hope you enjoyed this workout. I'm going to break it down into five circuits for you of strengthening. You're going to pick your intensity that works for you for that day. And let's get started.